welcome to Abadim Beach, yeah. in Sierra Leone. Okay. Here we are very, very happy people. Okay. Please come to Sierra Leone. Okay. And God will bless you. Guys, you Amen. hear that? Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, it's okay. It's love. It's love. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. It's love. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Yes, sir. Thank you very much, sir. That is love. Wow. I like your selfie stick. A selfie, thank you. Yeah. These guys are having a quality movement this morning, doing some exercise. Oh. Goal. That's a goal, guys. <laughs> yes, sir. Yes, guys. Uh, it's almost done. Yeah, the chat to the referee. Uh, good morning. Uh, good morning. Uh, guys, this is Abadin, and usually in the morning here, people come here to do some exercise, and these guys are yeah. playing soccer here. Yeah, of this course. is the referee. How is the match? Yes, God. I hope you are a fair referee, right? Of course, of you are course. not never in any of these things. At all, not. At all, Okay, not. guys, I can see. Hi, viewers. Once again, you welcome to my channel, and of course, I am Mumuko. If you're new to the channel, kindly subscribe, comment, and smash that notification bell, because we can go this channel together. And of course, viewers, today, I am at the western area of Freetown, uh, the western urban, you know, Aberdeen precisely, you know. Uh, today I'm not in the village, you know, I'm used uh, to being around the villages, the, uh, the suburbs, you know. Some people call me the village boy, but yeah, today I am at Aberdeen, uh, uh, one of the most prominent touristic hubs in Sierra Leone, which is home to uh, numerous hotels and nightclubs, restaurants, and uh, a different uh, touristic facilities in Sierra Leone. And of course, I will be taking you from the roundabout, uh, the Aberdeen roundabout, which is one of the biggest roundabouts in Sierra Leone. We'll be trekking straight to the beach, you know, uh, which is one of the most beautiful beaches in Sierra Leone again. So guys, let's make this journey together. Yeah, you just take a look around. Uh, this is the roundabout, and uh, yeah, this is Abadin. We'll be taking a tour to the beach. The road to the beach is over there, but you just look around the, the roundabouts. Uh, this roundabout is still under construction. It's a, it's a beautiful place now. The last time I visited here, uh, it wasn't like this, but then it has been maintained and yeah, it's still under construction though. So guys, let's make this move together. You know, the skyline here is different. You know, we are not in the village today. Used to be in the village, you know. Uh, some of my viewers used to call me the village boy, but today I'm in, in a different community, an urban setting, you know. And uh, this is Abadin, guys. I tell you, we shall be making this move straight to the beach, uh, which is one of the most prominent beaches here in Sierra Leone. So let's keep moving, guys. We're still around the runabout and uh, yeah, it's a quiet morning here. This is Freetown, this is Sabadee. We are, we are straight at the, at the roundabout. And this is Aberdeen and we are making the move straight to the beach. Yes guys, I, I am at a particular spot here, around the Aberdeen roundabout. And I meet some men here, some guys here willing to interact with me. So this will be our first interaction here in the community. One of the most popular attire bases in Aberdeen, around the roundabout. I tell you guys, uh, uh, people are all around here. This is where they have quite time to uh, to mingle, to interact, and socialize in the community. And so, as I told you, uh, let me interact with some people around here. This is Aberdeen. How is that? You see, you guys are having quality time here. Yeah, we're spending a nice time here, we're enjoying ourselves. You see, guys, so how is the community? Well, the community is nice and well, I feel like everything is doing well. Okay, guys, so the peaceful community, the vibe, okay, the vibe here is, uh, is quite the breeze here, is a sea breeze, which yes. is quite refreshing, guys. You can see guys are all around, you know. You see, yeah, yeah, ma'am. Yes, sir. Uh, good morning. Good. Yeah, how are you? Ah, uh, yes, yes, sir. You live here, right? Yeah. Ah, how long have you been living here? Ah, I've been here for long. For a very long time. Yeah. What is your experience so far in the community? Yeah. How many yeah. 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 okay. 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 yeah. okay. yeah. okay. I am also a club with the Okay. Because you like to dinner. Just kind of dinner to dinner. I need to put some that's a serious concern, guys. Exactly. The water supply, 
uh, here is a uh, is intermittent pros and cons, and the power supply is another thing to talk about. You know, it's nothing to write home about, and that's a concern here. I just uh, hope that uh, the council or the government should see reason to to make these things works a little bit uh, effective because the people here are suffering for water and electricity, and these are basic facilities that the people ought to enjoy because they are paying for it. Thank you very much. Sir. Yeah, yeah. Uh, yes, guys, as I told you, this spot, this center, uh, is a spot where people around here, elders and youth as well, come to socialize. And fortunately, I bumped into one of the elders here in the community. Yes, sir. Uh, good morning. Yeah, good morning. Yeah, you reside here in this community. Yeah, very close. To the house very right close. There. Yeah, his house is somewhere down there. Mm -hmm. And so, how is your community, sir? <laughs> The community, yeah. the, the, we have a lot of constraints in our community. A lot of constraints. A lot of constraints. Okay. Okay. One of those constraints are yeah. like uh, electricity. Electricity. We are suffering from electricity. Okay. Water supply. Water supply, okay. Um, yeah. Not that much good health facilities. Okay. We have a very uh, good health facility, but it's not for the public, like okay. it's for from, from 12 years to the women's center. Okay, okay. Okay. okay, pregnant women, yeah, and, and yeah. all, and all are good for that. Okay. For some of uh, for us elders here, yeah. when we are sick, we yeah. then in medical assistance, unless we have to go somewhere far from the any you. major hospital here. Okay. So that's a okay. by uh, guys, uh, what uh, the man is saying, the standard is saying here, yeah, there is no uh, fire hospital around here, okay. and that's a crisis. That's a major crisis because uh, uh, in, disease or illness can uh, break out at any time, and uh, it is sad that the people around here do not have a major hospital, a referral hospital. They have to move all the way to the east of Freetown or central Freetown. Uh, those are the places where you can find a fire hospital or you go to Longley, you know. And so this is a crisis here. This is a concern from the people of Aberdeen because uh, the man making this statement is an elder here. He has been here for quite a while and yet yeah, he understands the situation is here on ground. And those are the concerns he, he mentioned. No, no water supply, electricity is a crisis here. Uh, health, health concern here is a crisis. No health uh, facility. No water facility, no, no electricity, and this is this is bad, you know. You know, hygiene goes with water. When there is no water, it's a crisis, and the people here do not have water, guys. So that is it. Uh, thank you very much, sir. I wanted to add another concern. Go ahead, go ahead. Another concern is yeah. Because here is a touristic area. Oh, exactly. Here yeah. all the entertainment places are located. Yeah, the yeah. hotels, the restaurants, the, the, the casinos, the casinos. Oh yes. So we have a problem with yeah. prices of commodities, basic good commodities. Oh, commodities. Okay. They are very hard to come by. Okay. When you okay. come by them, they, they are so expensive. They are ah. almost out of the reach of the ordinary man. So it's like you are being you are being treated as a as tourist. Yeah, right? because this is the this is a foreign guys, place. guys. That's uh, because of the place, the location of the place. When those people who uh, would say they are petty petty merchandise, as soon as they cross that bridge, yeah, they change their prices. Guys, when you uh, go to North Court and other places, it gets a better price. Yeah. For as long as they enter, even on the mango, they sell them at very exorbitant prices. Oh yeah. So uh, guys, food stuff. Yeah. Guys, for some of oil, okay. rice, those other basic things people used to, to cook. Okay. They are so expensive. A bunch of oil costs at the moment. Ten thousand euros. Ten thousand euros. Yes. Guys, that's a crisis. That's too much. For some of us living outside Aberdeen or outside Peter, we admire people living here. Unknown to us that uh, uh, there are a silent crisis uh, that these people are going through here. You see, we, we admire the community uh, uh, by, by virtue of the fact that it is closer to uh, the beach and it's a touristic hub. But here, yeah, the people here are undergoing a crisis that is silent. And uh, yes, yeah, sometimes they don't have the media to vent this crisis out. Um, but here you hear now, when you are here, if you are here, residing here, you are being treated as a tourist because uh, it, is a, it, is a, it is a perception that people who live here have money. But this is not the case. There are locals here who live just like the people in the village, you know. But when you are here, if, or if you just come here to visit, trust me, 
the person is there a height, you know. As as soon as you, as soon as you've crossed the bridge, the Abain bridge, which uh which is the longest bridge here in the Sierra Leone, the, 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 the prices change, you know. It's a it's a different stuff. Oil here is a uh, ten thousand euros, which which is a which is a problem. It's a crisis. It's affecting the locals here, and that is a concern here, which uh, many people are not aware of. Guys, this is it. This is Abadin. A silent crisis here. Silent suffering from the people of Abadin. You know, and uh, yeah, government should see this in as to how to how to how to deal with these issues because it affected the people here. This is Abadin. I'm around the roundabout, and yeah, we are moving now to the to the beach area. Thank you very much, sir. No yes, sir. Come yeah. come yes, guys, that is it. So, guys, uh, we are moving. That is the spot. Uh, the attire base is a popular base here, a popular spot here. And so, uh, we are moving around. Uh, this is Abadin, and uh, I tell you, this is the uh, this is the roundabout. Uh, this is the Abadin community, and we are moving straight to the beach. You see, can you see? is a, a beautiful spot here. This road here uh, leads to Central Freetown and of course uh, uh, we are getting down there uh, to, the, uh, to, the, to the beach. You know. uh, the road is somehow busy but uh, we need to be a bit careful guys. Uh, yeah. <laughs> you see uh, this is Abadin and you see the landscape is quite uh, an amazing community. Uh, I think the youth here today have something to do and we are still at the Abadin roundabout. It's quite a busy morning here and we are moving straight to the beach. So guys, let's keep moving. It's morning here. But this is Freetown, this is Abadin. Ah uh, guys, I tell you, you see, you watch the skyline here. It's a busy morning. We're going to, we're going to the beach. I tell you, we are going to the, to the beach, right? Can you hear the sound? Uh, the sound there is coming from uh, there are some people over there uh, passing to the beach. And that, uh, I met some brothers here. It's morning here, and it's a quiet morning here. And I met some brothers here. Good morning. How are you guys? Good, you also. Yeah, cool, brother. Yes, I do. Thanks and thanks, bro. Yes, I. That's a brother, guys. So we are moving now. We are moving to the beach, guys. Yes. Ah, it's morning here, guys. This is Freetown. This is Abadin. But uh, the issue here, guys, uh, there are several concern of the locals living here. Uh, not the tourists, but the locals, because once you are here, you are being considered uh, as a as a tourist. You know that not everyone that is here is a tourist. That is it. The people are undergoing several constraints here, just as the people said over there. So this is Abadin. We are far away now from the roundabout, and we are moving straight to the beach, guys. Uh, at the Abadin beach, you see, uh, people having a uh, moment this morning. That's a good jogging. They are jogging straight to the beach. So, guys, let's make this move. Let's get this done. It's morning here, and this is Abadin. You see, it's quite busy. It's quite busy. You need to be a bit careful because there are cars coming back. Uh, this is Sunday. It's Sunday here, and uh, this place is quite busy today because uh, the place is known for, for entertainment. You see, uh, people all around. Okay, it's trying to see. Yeah, guys, we need to be a bit careful. Yeah, yes, guys. Uh, and so we are moving. This is our thing, and uh, we are going straight to the beach. Get to the beach. No kidding, guys. Let's keep going, you know. I do not want to get closer to, to that uh, to that convoy because uh, uh, it's a bit noisy. So we need to go a little bit slower so as to uh, as to get my comments, you know. Can you see, uh, people are coming from the beach. I told you the beach is somewhere right down there, and uh, people who went there this morning to jog are returning back, you know. Uh, some stays at uh, at the Central Free Town and some people around here. Uh, at this uh, fire service station, you know, the Abadin fire service station. Can you see that? You watch around. Uh, the fence you are seeing uh, is like that is in blue. 
uh, one of the one of the five star hotels here in uh, in Sierra Leone, guys. Uh, that fence over there, India is what is in me, you know. Guys, people down there, can you see? Yeah, they are having a, a match, you know, a jogging match like along the street to the beach, guys. And uh, we are going straight to, uh, how are you going? Straight to the beach, guys. You see the boy? <laughs> yeah. Guys. It's morning here, I don't get it twisted. And the the breeze here is uh, is quite refreshing, I tell you. We came right from that place and uh, yeah, we are moving straight to uh to the beach. This is Freetown, this is somebody guys. Uh, uh, Never a dog woman's hair. This is Sabadin. You know, uh, it's a popular spot for entertainment, uh, tourism, and all the stuff here in Peter. You know, so we are moving here, guys. This compound here is that is a blue compound, and we watch around. You know, yes, sir. Yes, sir. Guys are complimenting my efforts. My selfie stick, um, uh, which is a, uh, which is an improvised one from uh, from God, you know. But yeah, that is what I've got, and I've got to use it, you know, to to do what I have passion for. Guys, can you see? This is Abadin, and uh, we are moving straight to straight to the beach. It's a busy morning here, and. Uh, it is a quiet environment, but yeah, it's home to, uh, to numerous hotels, uh, nightclubs, bars, restaurants, and, and many tourist facilities. You know. Can you see? Guys, people are moving around. Let's get there and see. Yeah, guys, you see, we are closer to the beach now, and uh, yes, we are moving to the beach now and see exactly uh, what is going on there because it's never a dull moment here. So let's keep going, guys. You see, the place over there is the Cape of Freetown, you know. Yeah, it stretches a little bit into the sea, you know. We need to keep moving, guys. We need to keep moving. Everybody is busy here this morning. Yeah, and this place is uh, usually uh, busy, you know, because you want to get entertained and you come here. See, even the other riders, the bike men, uh, are happy this morning because the people are all around. And so, you can have pylons here. This morning, this is uh, this is Abadin, and uh, we are having a, a quality moment here this morning, guys. And you see, we need to cross. We need to move, and uh, this is around about here at the beach, at the Abadin beach. Around about is here, and we are almost at the at the beach now. Good morning. We are almost at the beach now, and there's a... Hey, man, what's up, yeah, man? Brother, how are you? I like, I don't know it's called Latin. It's selfie, right? I like this selfie, man. Okay, that's it. Let's go. Peace out. Yeah. Guys, you see, we are at the beach now. These are roundabouts. Can you see? And can you see that, uh, that group? Uh, they are still uh, marching along the beach, you know? Yeah, let's get here. Yeah. Uh, we are going to the beach. I tell you, just watch. You just look. Ah, we are. We are at the at the roundabout. Uh, in my view, uh, 
biggest roundabouts in Freetown, if not Sayon. It's very, very large. You know? This is the roundabout painted all over with green, white, and blue, guys. Green, white, and blue paint all over. And, uh, can you see? Uh, this is sweet on guys, it's refreshing. Beauty is here, guys. The beach side, it's quiet and peaceful. We are moving right there. I tell you, we're moving right there now. I showed you, I've shown you the, the roundabout. Now we are going straight to the beach, guys. Ah. It's morning here, guys. Can you see? We are right at the we are right at the beach, you know. And these are resorts all over the beach, you know. I met some brothers here who are willing to interact with me. It's quite a busy morning here, and they're refreshing one as well. Good morning. Good morning. Yeah, I'm fine. I am a mobile. I need babies, and you come here this morning to exercise, guys. Uh, I tell you, it's never a dull moment here at this beach. This is Sabadin Beach. So you want to come here? If you know why, or you don't. It's 8 o'clock, wow. And what, what is your experience so far here this morning? Ah, this is a just move around. You just yeah, move around. Just okay, it's quite right. Yeah. It's peaceful, right? Yeah. Yes, I got yeah. yeah. There are some brothers here too. You can see them with their boots, which means they've played soccer here this morning, isn't it? Oh, you want to play soccer? You want to play soccer? Yeah, yeah, no, I'm not playing. Yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah. You see, guys, uh, there's a boots, you know? When you come to the beach, you have to do something to keep yourself fit. And this is exactly what the brothers are about to do. See this again with his. <laughs> I wish I can play too. How is that? Fine, I'm fine. And yeah, I can see you guys are having a quiet time and a busy time this morning here. The sea breeze is giving you a quality time, right? Yeah, it Wow, today is Sunday, guys, and during the Sundays here, this beach is always busy. And so we should be moving around. We'll be getting right over there. Thank you very much, sir. Yes, sir. Thank you very much. Okay, well, thank you. So guys, we need to move around. I am here at the Abadin Beach, and it's quite a, a busy morning here. Just watch around. There are like resorts all around here, guys. You see, at the beach. Yes, I thank you. <laughs> yeah, guys, uh, this is the beach. You see, resorts all around. You know, pubs, you know, restaurants all around the beach, guys. 24 hours food. Yeah, this is a beach. Uh, this is the beauty of Freetown. This is the beauty of Sahel, you know. We are never short of beaches, you know. A beach all around, you know, because a Freetown is a peninsula surrounded by water, surrounded by beaches, you know. I tell you, let's take a, a, a walk around, guys. Can you see? Let's cross here. Yeah. Uh, guys. Yeah, thank you, guy. Uh, these are Family Kingdom resorts. Can you see? It's a popular resort here at Abadin Beach, guys. Yes, I met a brother here, guys. Welcome to Abadin Beach. Yeah. In Sierra Leone. Okay. Here we are very, very happy people. Okay. Please come to Sierra Leone. Okay. And God will bless you. Guys, you hear that? That peace, come, you welcome here and God will bless you, you know. Sun language is to go here, it's yeah. love, it's peace. Okay. You know what I mean? That's what we say, you know what I mean? When you go around on the beach, you know what I mean? This free time, you know what I mean? A nice view, you know what I mean? Nice Nothing waste away. Indeed, when guys. think about okay. you know, what we got. Okay. It's all about love, it's all about it's peace. It's all about love. Peaceful it's about people. Enjoying yourself. Loving people, guys. But don't forget, free town. Yeah. Great free town is, is a place whereby you never found the dance floor. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. There's love. There's, There's love. The sun to your chest. You know what I'm talking about? All around, the guys. The right now, but sunshine <laughs> is just the best. It's the just fish, the best, you the know. The crabs. The everything. Lobster. The lobster. Everything is here, guys. It's all the best. Peace, you hear you know? that, Thank right? you, okay. brother. One love from persons with disability in Sierra Leone. One love from Remember persons that? with disability One in love. Sierra Leone. Guys, One you love. hear that? All right. One love. Peace. Right. Guys, I'm still here at the Abadin Beach, and I met an old man here, a friend, too. Good morning, sir. Good morning. I'm fine. Uh, what's your name? Abbas Bangura. Pa Abbas Bangura. Guys, uh, Mr. Bangura uh, creates these things. He's an artist. He creates all these clothes. You know, can you see African stuffs, guys? Just look around. Can you see? Uh, these are created by uh, uh, Mr. Bangura. You see, I think I'll buy one here 
uh, probably these with the green, white, and blue, you know. And uh, yeah, just to help, uh, just to help the man, you know. That's my help to him because he's doing great here. You see, African stops all around, guys. African stops all around. How much is this stuff? Well, we said we have 10,000 dollars. Okay, I will volunteer to buy one, right? Okay. To help you guys. So, how long have you been doing this business? Well, this business, I don't do it more than six years ago. Wow, over six years ago, he has been doing this business. Wow, so how is it? How is business? Well, the business, Friday, the business, all right. Okay. But now, yeah. business, tourist, no deal. Okay. Okay, guys, uh, guys need to visit Sierra Leone. Yeah? The old man is saying uh, there used to be a flow of tourists here previously, but now it's a little bit scarce. He's a big stop. Different, different stop. Okay. He does this himself. Okay, okay. He wants to show us something. And the brother is still around me. Uh, yeah. A friendly brother. I, I just want to just show you. I mean, um, when you come to Kuta, okay. you can meet deaf children dancing. Okay. To tell you, we are alive. Deaf children, guys. These are these are deaf children. They are the deaf. They are deaf. Yeah, they are deaf. From the deaf school, guys. They are dancing. Can you see that? To show they are alive. They dancing Celine Dion. Wow. So when you come over, you can see this. That is to show you these the kids are, they are alive. You know, they can do many things. You know. Can you see that? Wow, that is it, guys. Thank you very much, yes, sir. Wow, yes, back to the old man. He's showing us. I did do, and they make okay speak, and they make giraffe, and they make the fish. Okay, yeah, see, uh, this is what he does, guys. Uh, he's very creative, guys. It's like cocos fish, yes, cocos fish, guys. Uh, he's very creative of the man, you know. You see, this is giraffe. Wow, you see that, guys. I wish I can afford to buy this shoe. You know. uh, this is very, very nice, guys. Yeah. And they do this already. Wow. There's a stick, right? Okay, stick. Okay. You see? This is here, too. I mean, I work this already. Wow. Do it yourself. Do it yourself. Yes, yes. Guys, you hear that? He does this himself, you know? You know? But this do... is a bit slow right now, right? Well, it's slow because not only it's... Okay. Only in a manageable, but anyway, we say go take it. Do you live in Abadin here? No, we are live in uh, Kuntolo. Kuntolo? Yeah, Kuntolo. Wow. Yes, now in a manageable, but anyway, we say go take it for the life. Okay, yeah. Okay. We manage. Okay. Most more. Yeah. So he lives in Kuntolo, that's the east end of Freetown, you know. But he usually come here with this stuff yeah. uh, for the tourists, you know. Yes. And family for kingdom. interested people who want to buy African I stuff. Family know. kingdom. Family kingdom, you know. Okay. They give you this place to sell, yes. right? Mr. Pajawar, now he give me this place. Jawar, Mr. Jawar, the owner of the Family Kingdom Resort, uh, gave him permission to sell here. Yes. You know, and that is a good, good thing, you yes. know, from that man, you know. Yes. Because uh, the old man needs somewhere to raise money from, you know. I'm buying this from the old man usually along the street. This is sold at 5,000 leons uh, from him here. It's 10,000 leons, but yes, yeah, someone needs to support him, you know. And that's why exactly I'm buying this from him, you know. And uh, as he said, business is somehow stiff right now because uh, there is not too much influx of tourists here uh, at the beach right now, you know. And yeah, that's disturbing for an old man that is creative, you know. And so I, I I'll buy this. Ah, uh, this is 10,000 million Salonian uh, money, you know. Tell him thank okay. you. Yeah, oh, it's okay. It's not to money. Yeah, it's not. Tell him thank you. Okay. Yes, sir. Thank you very much, sir. That is not. He's an old man. He's a father figure, you know. Thank you very much, sir. And that is it, guys. Look at the stuff he does. You know, very creative. He doesn't want to be idle. That's why he's doing this. Thank you very much. Okay, thank you. Yes, sir. Yeah. Guys, I'm putting this on now. This, yeah. You see? Green, white, and blue. Yes, guys. Wow. Busy this morning, guys. Very, very busy. That's the ocean. Uh, the breeze is disturbing the sound system. You know, and uh, yeah, but I'll do something more. I'm right at the beach, and uh, people are having a quiet time here this morning. Doing some exercise. Good morning, guys. Yes, I, it's morning there, guys. Yeah, yeah. Uh, guys are all around playing soccer, you know. Yeah. Ah, uh, good morning. 
Yes, guys, I am still here, and uh, I guys are playing soccer here. You see, uh, you just watch around, guys. Watch around. Everyone is here this morning. And you see, wow. uh, this is the beauty of Freetown. These guys are having a quality movement this morning, doing some exercise. Uh, it's morning here, and the guys are, are playing soccer here. Can you see? It's fun out here. <laughs> wow. Can you see? Yes. Uh, this is the FIE. He's getting the match right now. See? You see that? <laughs> That's from the FIE. Straight from the FIE. You. It's fun out here. I tell you. It's never a dull moment at Aberdeen Beach. Are you? Wow. You see? Goal. That's a goal, guys. <laughs> yes, I. Yes, guys. Uh, it's almost done. Yeah, the chat to the referee. Uh, good morning. Uh, good morning, uh, guys. Also. This is Aberdeen, and usually in the morning here, people come here to do some exercise, and these guys are yeah. playing soccer here. Yeah, of this course. is the referee. How is the match? Yes, uh, <laughs> God. I hope you are a fair referee, guys. Right? Of course, of you course. You are not in any of these things. At all, not. At all, Okay, not. guys, I can see. Uh, and thank you. This is Aberdeen. I am Amuko, and uh, we are moving here now. Yes, guys, I am still here at, uh, at Aberdeen. You just look around. It's a, it's a quiet place, a beautiful beach. The landscape here is, a, is, quite, a, is quite amazing, guys. Uh, 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 this is a real estate. Uh, uh, a cozy one as well. Can you see that? Right. And uh, it stretches far and wide because uh, this is a beach side. I can see it's written a uh, Dream Atlantic Villa, you know, uh, small restaurants, hotels, and uh, bars as well, guys. Uh, this is a Badin Beach, and uh, it's crazy out here. So let me, let me come. You want to interact with me? Let, let me come around here. Uh, there are people here who are willing to interact with me. These are. Uh, uh, a bar here uh, at the beach. Aisha Hotcake Beach Bar. Aisha Hotcake. I think there's a bar up here. Let me show you this, you know. And uh, if you happen to visit uh, Freetown, Sierra Leone, check out this place, you know. It's quite an amazing place. You see that? Uh, it's Aisha Hotcake. Guys, you get it hot here when you come here. So, they're getting and interact with the people in here. Good morning. Good morning. Yeah. Good morning. Wow. I like your selfie stick. A selfie, thank you. Yes. How are you? Unique. Wow. Uh, you you own here? That's the owner. That's, That's a madam, right? Your sister. Oh, okay. Yes. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, the madam is experienced in a sort of fever, but here yeah, I should interact with her sister. Mm -hmm. So how is business here? Well, good with thank God. Okay. It's moving. Okay, it's moving. Wow. Guys, you need to check out here. It's never a dull moment here. I was passing by and uh, yeah. Uh, she commented on my selfie stick, which has been a center of attraction since I have been making this move today. But then I tell you, in here is quite a, a relaxing place. You need to check here if you happen to come in Sierra Leone. Yeah. If you are outside Sierra Leone, you visit Sierra Leone, check out Aisha Hotkick, you know. Yeah. And, uh, right at the beach at Aberdeen Beach. Aberdeen beach you know. Kalon Kapak. Kalon Kapak, you know. Yes. Check out here, and you will surely meet this lady here, and you will interact with her too, because it's never a dull moment here. Everything here, you get it hot. I tell you, because it's Aisha's hot tea. Thank you very much. Yes, guys, brother, how are you? Nice one. Yeah, it's a brother here too. I am a Muko.